I know that the ALAS is pivotal in creating some great policy outcomes to, to help make those goals happen. Give us a 30,000 foot view of the ALAS, if you could. What should people know about this organization? What does it do? What does your membership look like? What kind of support do you provide? The 30,000 foot. Well, you know, I used to say that as a superintendent, that's the 30,000 foot level. I look at ALAS or ALAS um, as more of a 50,000 foot. (laughs) And the reason I say that is because our membership is expanding and is very expansive because it's across the U.S., including the territory of Puerto Rico. And so as we grow um, our state affiliates, so does grow our membership. And what we're about um, a, across you know, the, the nation is really uplifting um, the notion that if you sit at our table, not only um, will you learn from each other, uh, but you will also be able to share um, how, what works and what doesn't work in the Latino community. Because the Latino community is so diverse in and of itself that the perspectives that we bring um, from our backgrounds and from our geographic locations is one where uh, we're able to be able to, you know, provide that look uh, into what works best for kids in our schools. And as you know, our Latino students are the majority of students in public um, in the public education system. And so, what we bring to our members is not only the opportunity for participate um, from within their states, but because we offer different kinds of programs and services, I think that that's um, probably uh, in a nutshell, the 50,000 foot level view of it. 